going to be the title of this video. Was every pair backdoored, bro? Because, oh my god, what the heck is going on here? There's nothing, there's no pairs listed up. Size 12 ask is $2,000. Hey man, say man, it's Armand Too Real in the cut on the mic. As you can see in today, man, I'm gonna be coming back at y'all with another type of like sneaker discussion video. I'm just gonna get straight into this video. We're gonna be talking about the Trophy Room Home Jordan ones, not the away ones. They did the away ones a few months ago. I was able to snag two pairs of those because those were a lot more like widely available, especially if you lived in Florida, like near like Orlando, aka the Trophy Room store, because like Trophy Room store is like in Orlando, like downtown area. So, um, yeah, if you lived in downtown area or you just lived like near Orlando and you were able to make the trip, or if you're just crazy and you lived in like, let's say, let's say on the other side of the state, like Miami or something, you're just crazy and you just wanted to get the shoe so bad that you drove from a Miami or whatever, or on the other side of the state, whether wherever you live in Florida, like far out, like if you're more than three hours away, I salute you for making that drive, but at the same time, you're kind of brazy, bro. But um, yeah, anyways, though, they um they just came out with the homes. Um, They entered, they gave out like the winners, like they sent out winners today. They did a two day raffle with the 23rd and 24th pretty sure and then yeah well, i know that and then they um called out the winners today the 25th and um they called out winners by 12 unfortunately i made the two hour trip so i guess i'm one of those crazy people because two hours and three hours isn't too big of a difference but um i really the way i drive i made it like an hour 45 but um yeah anyways um, I, I was able to make it to Orlando. I live in like, you know, I'm not going to, you know, that's the kind of disclosed information. But um, anyways, yeah, I don't, I live about an hour and a half, about two hours away from um, Orlando with traffic. Uh, so I was able to make the trip to go enter up this raffle because I knew that this pair was going to be super exclusive. So that's what was kind of deterring me from even making the drive because I knew it was a very slim chance of me hitting. And I was able to get two um, family, like friends, like that were able to like to go enter up. Apparently they um, entered up like, um, two people but anyways it's you know anyways uh, i got some other people to enter up so yeah because like this was a drop that you want to get all your friends all your family if you have some close homies that are willing to like go to the store which it's not a big hassle at all all you have to do is walk in the store and tell them your information and then dip out it's literally it takes two minutes plus it's a dope store to check out like trophy room store you just see like some mj cool stuff and like some og i saw some og breads in there that were from like 1980s that were crumbled and stuff like there's a lot of cool things in there nothing too crazy they don't have like crazy stuff but they do get dope drops so um this isn't like a trophy room promotion or none but they do get some dope drops whenever they do come out stuff like that but let me take a sip of water real quick yeah but i was able to hit two pairs because i entered up um on um you know under my mom and me last time for the trophy rooms and i was able to secure a size 7 and 12.5 but i know that pair they had about 10k pairs or 12k or 15k pairs in the store the home version which is like i'm gonna pop it on the screen they're like very slightly different from the way ones they just have like a white swoosh and white inner and apparently they come with like a rookie card but um bro i'm starting to think that all these pairs were backdoored because you know, when people get their pairs, like for example, my dog's walking in, but the away version, whenever people got their away version, they threw them right up on the apps, threw them right up on StockX. StockX was filled. Every size was available on StockX in the away version the day that people were able to grab them, you know, like whenever winners were selected. So like, for example, today was like the, the, day, the day they gave out winners. For example, this day, like a couple months ago, whenever for the away version, StockX was filled. Everyone put their shoes on apps, which I don't really highly recommend if you're trying to maximize your profit try to get a local sale for example whenever i walked out of the trophy room store i literally had a guy in a truck go check out that video of me picking up my trophy rooms you can literally see the whole rundown the guy offered me eleven hundred dollars well he was offering me like originally like 800 or something like that but i got him up to 1100 and i don't know what made me walk away but i walked away bro apparently i thought i could get like 1300 but um hey it is what it is you know what i'm saying but right now i'm looking at market i'm gonna pop it up on the screen there is barely any sizes available these homes so i did hear a youtuber um you know i did hear a youtuber um talk about how like these were gonna be super limited and he was honestly correct bro because dude i'm looking at market right now in nine and a half there's only one available on stock x someone threw them up uh only one available in a size nine my cat just came in here um there's only one available in a size six someone the offers are crazy i just popped on the screen a 10 bands in a size 11 that's ask though realistically there's going to be a sale for 1500 in a size 11 which is insane so if i hit on that bro man i would have been thankful because dude i would fifteen hundred dollars for a pair of shoes in 2024 what shoes flipping like that nowadays none so yeah if you can get your hands on a shoe like that yeah hallelujah you know what i'm saying straight up because i know a lot of people are against resellers but hey i don't care i like money and that is what it is and if you if you disagree with me stay broke now i'm just playing all right i know it's gonna piss off a lot of people but if you're a real hustler you're gonna be like yes sir that's that's some facts right there i'm gonna go get my pair and i'm gonna make my money because 
hey that's what a real one's gonna do but i'm not gonna make this video into a rant i just want to talk about how this is crazy 10 bands for the asking price um last sale um was like fifth like last sale was a thousand dollars so that means realistically they're going to be selling pairs are going to be realistically sell, selling for around a thousand bucks to two thousand dollars depending the size a size eight which is a bad size like a very uneven size sold for a thousand dollars this morning at 10 57 which is just insane bro apparently nobody hit apparently every pair was backdoored so was every pair backdoor gonna be the title of this video was every pair backdoored bro because oh my god what the heck is going on here there's nothing there's no pairs listed up size 12 ask is two thousand dollars last sale was 555 but that was like a, that was tw that was the 23rd so apparently a pair got backdoored and some of the sold them for 550 bucks which is really low they undersold the heck out of that but um yeah that can't be real honestly that must have been like a fake someone sold but um anyways though there's crazy ass right now and this is pretty much all i want to talk about in this video was is this pair getting backdoored because like there's no pairs listed and today winners were supposed to be selected and you know people aren't just letting that pair sit at the trophy room store if they get if they got that text saying they won they're on their way to that trophy room store to pick up their pair because this pair is way more exclusive than the away version and people were going dumb for the away version apparently trophy room shoes always go for some bread i remember when the highs came out apparently the trophy room frozen moment highs whenever they came out people were camping out for those i know a lot of local resellers than me that camped out for that pair like i wasn't really in the sneaker game at that um, moment like I was, i've always been in the sneakers but i wasn't really like in the game i wasn't really like keeping up the like like you know i wasn't keeping up with the drops that were coming out and like what boutiques were getting what exclusive drop or none like that and what shoes were coming out this type of moment i wasn't keeping up bro so it is insane the like the hype on trophy room shoes but um yeah the trophy room homes they are limited y'all i don't know I entered in for a size 10 yesterday. I honestly made a mistake because it looks like there's zero size 10s. Apparently, all of them went out the back door or none. there's none created because what the heck? There's not even a size 10 listed on StockX right now. So this is just insane. That makes me feel a lot better for not hitting because apparently nobody hit. So yeah, I just want to make this video a quick video talking here. Let me see how long this video has been. Seven minutes long. I don't want this video to be too much of a rant or too long. But yeah, pretty much all I want to talk about was um, how this pair was a super exclusive and like, yeah, hold on one sec, y'all. Back into what I was saying is pretty much all I want to talk about in this video is how this pair is super exclusive and like how market is going crazy right now. So yeah, man, if you got your hands on these, count yourself blessed, count yourself very lucky because dude, oh my gosh, it is insane right now market because I don't know, there hasn't been many sales. Like I said, realistically, I see these things selling for around $800 to high $1,750 which is insane that's a travis scott right there like literally like this is crazy bro and these aren't even too different from the trophy room aways right now the aways i'm just gonna look at market on the ways out of curiosity yeah on the ways they're like ranging from 350 to 400 so honestly it looks like somebody just got those aways bulk and to start selling them for 350 like they got them through the back door and then they started selling them off for 350 because you know retail on them is 140 so if you do the math 140 times two that's like 280 so they're pretty much just trying to get double what they paid so yeah that makes sense but dude the ways were going for some crazy money too i remember when i hit there my pair was going for one of my sizes was going for 650 and then the other size seven um like the batter size was going for 500 so yeah they were i could i was thinking okay i can get like 1150 on these so yeah bro that that was insane i got you know i, I ain't gonna sell how much like i ain't gonna tell how much i like sold it for because that ain't none of y'all business but yeah i sold it for a pretty penny my two pairs so that was a very good um hit and i hope some more sneakers come like come out like this but they're very hard to come by that's why when they do come out they go for crazy bread like the homes are just they must be exclusive bro because nobody hit apparently like i don't see many dubs and i'm i'm you know i can't wait to see over the past the, over the next few days if there's going to be a lot of pairs on stock x or we're going to find out there was little to none pairs because oh my gosh bro i don't see no pairs on stock x but um yeah bro i'm gonna end up the video here drop a like drop a sub all that good stuff and i'm gonna end up the video here peace out